Hey everybody, Tom Sparks with Sparks Media Group. Today I'm going to show you the process of extracting email addresses from your email accounts. Why would you want to do this? Well, I have several email accounts set up, uh, usually using Gmail or Google Suite, and uh, there's a lot of contacts that I exchange emails with. Um, I don't have all of their email addresses in my email distribution list. So when I send out marketing emails, I'm missing out on potential sales, potential customers by not having their email addresses in my distribution list. So I'm going to show you the process of extracting all these emails. Uh, the first step is you sign into your Gmail account, which I am here, as you can see. Then you're going to click the nine dots to go to Google Apps on the top right. Once you do that, you're going to scroll down and select Contacts, and it's going to open up a new tab. Now, I don't have any emails saved as contacts, so there's not going to be any showing up here. Uh, but I do have some that I frequently contact. So we're going to pull that list up, and then we're going to select the first contact. And then from there, we're going to do Selection, Actions, and Select All. Next, we're going to click on these three dots for more actions and we're going to export. Now I'm going to do selected contacts as a Google CSV and hit export. Then I'm going to go down to other contacts. Now the difference is frequently contacted is ones that I exchange emails with a lot. Uh, and Google just kind of automatically puts email or puts people in that bucket if I send emails back and forth to them a lot. Other contacts should be for everybody else. So we're going to again select the first one, go up here and select all, and then export. We're going to hit selected contacts and Google CSV. Now there's probably going to be duplicates and I'll show you how to deal with that in a second. Once we have everything done, everything exported, we're done here with uh, Google. So we'll switch over to Excel. Now, here in my downloads, you'll see that I have a few Excel files. One of them is called Clients, which is my master list that I've created. The other two are Contacts and Contacts 1, which are the export files that we just uh, exported from Gmail. I've opened Contacts and Contacts 1, and you can see that here, and it extracts a lot of information. You have name, family name, uh, there's all kinds of information that it shows, but um, we really only care about the email address, which is on the far right. Now you may want to import first name and last name. I don't typically care about that, so I'm going to leave that off, uh, but once you're you have this pulled up, uh, you simply take all the email addresses and then you can copy and paste them into a different spreadsheet or into your uh, favorite email distribution list. I happen to use uh, Send it, Send in Blue, and that's worked out for me, but there's also MailChimp and several others. So uh, that's the process. Um, if you happen to have, and I'll show you how to do this real quick, we'll, we'll copy this list from contacts one and I'm going to put it in contacts two. Now just so you know contacts, the first contacts was uh, the frequently contacted and that was here. Contacts one is everybody and that's there. Now there's probably going to be duplicates so what you can do is highlight these, go to data and then hit uh, remove duplicates. You want to expand the selection and then hit OK and it's going to say none were found. So this is now a clean list of all the contacts uh, that I have on that particular email account and there's 118. That's a fairly new email address so I only have 118 people that I've been contacting but throughout all my other email accounts um, I have quite a few. So that's the process. Uh, and now we have that many more email addresses to market to. 
you have any questions, uh, comment below. Like the video if you like it. Um, share it if you find it useful. And subscribe if you're not subscribed already. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.